Is there anything wrong with gay marriage? <laughs> no. There's nothing weird about that, do you think? No, no, let people love. As long as they're consenting adults? Yeah, of course. That's fine, right? Yeah. So, do you have any problem? Would you think it would be weird if one of your friends was having sex with their sister? How, how does that relate? Well, they're two consenting adults, so we're just uh, using liberal logic if you think that it's totally normal to have a homosexual relationship. I, I hate the idea, but if both are happy with it and they don't have any kids, then like, sure, I don't see a huge problem with it. So you think incest marriage is, is, is okay? Nothing weird about that? No, it's super weird, but if it's not hurting anybody, then I don't care. So by calling it weird though, aren't you being a bigot and an incest phobe like the liberals are saying the Christians are for saying that gay people are weird? You're, you're, you're an incest phobe? You a bigot against? I mean, incest? it makes me it makes it makes me uncomfortable. Okay. So, is there anything wrong if a Christian or a conservative thinks that homosexuals are weird or mm -hmm. it makes them uncomfortable to see these people on television? Uh, do you think that there's something? Do you think they're being bigots because they think that it's perverted to and makes them feel uncomfortable to see these uh, this gay agenda? I think it's I think it's fine as long as they're not hating on anybody. As long as they're not hurting people and insulting them just you got to just let people what they do what they want to do it's like the incest thing not into it but if people are that's fine with me it doesn't affect me i don't want them to have kids because you know there's some biologically like messed up stuff possibly so you would approve of incest marriage then <laughs> <laughs> i mean sure why why not what do you say about the people who say that homosexuals are disgusting? What do you feel about those critics of the LGBT community? I think they're disgusting. You think they're disgusting? Yeah. So you, you agree that two consenting adults should be able to have a sexual relationship of their preference without being called disgusting or perverts, correct? Yeah. So if uh, one of your best friends was having sex with his sister, uh huh. Would you say that's disgusting or perverted? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that's so you're an incest phobe then? So so you are judgmental about two consenting adults having a sexual relationship. Well, like relationship the thing about then. incest is that if the woman it's were not to become pregnant, that there's severe birth defects to the child, so. Let's say they're not going to have children though. Well, so you're it you're could still happen. They're they're not going to have children. They're just they're having a consensual incestuous relationship. So you think that's disgusting? Well, that's fine. If if they're not going to have kids, there's no there's no reason for me to judge them. So there's nothing wrong with a brother and a sister having sexual relations with each not other. Not if they're not going to have kids. Totally normal. Yeah. All right. <laughs> thank you. Just checking. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. If one of your best friends wanted to marry his sister and have a sexual relationship with her, would that be acceptable? Is that is that unusual? I would say that's unusual. Would you say that that's perverted and disgusting? I don't know. Um, again, to each their own. You know, it's not really for me. So it's unusual, to judge. but it's not abnormal and perverted and disgusting. It's not really for me to judge not my place to judge what other people do. I mean, who am I? If the sister wants it and the brother wants it, go for it, dude. If the guy has a vasectomy and there's no children involved, would you no do... No children? Yeah. So you I wouldn't tell them not to do what they want to do, but I wouldn't do it. If your friend here wanted to have sex with her brother, would that be abnormal or... Perverted? I don't really think people should judge other people or tell them what to do, so... So you I, I would... You would think that'd be okay? No, I don't have any opinion either way. It's not my decision whether or not it's okay. No opinion at all? Nope. So if you were to see them making out... That would be me infringing on their privacy, probably, so... No, if you're out at a, at a barbecue and they're holding hands and kissing each other, would that, wouldn't, would that make you feel like they're weird? It's not my business. I don't, it's not my decision whether or not someone's weird. We're just talking about how it would make you feel. It doesn't matter. I can't control the way it would make me feel. I can just control the way I react to the way it makes me feel. Well, you can, we want to know how you feel about the <laughs> I incest. feel like I want to go to the beach. You're so. at the beach. <laughs> Have a good day. Okay, thank you. Is incest acceptable in the safe space without being judgmental if some folks want to practice incest? Is that, are they going to be welcomed in your safe space? Um. If there are two consenting adults? Like, if they're two consenting adults, 
I mean, I guess so. <laughs> so like if a father and his daughter were having a sexual relationship, as long as they were over 18, you wouldn't be judgmental? You would allow them in your safe space? They're part of the yeah. LGBT community. Yeah, if uh, yeah, if that's if they both wanted to and were like within totally sober and cognitive and consenting states of adults. mind, yeah. Okay. And you're not being sarcastic at all. No, no I'm you're, not. You're very no. serious. Yeah. Because they're afraid to judge. Oh, just let people be. This is how brain damaged America has become. Afraid to criticize incest as weird. Afraid to be labeled bigots. They're afraid to be labeled judgmental or incest phobes.